Hi guys, Daz here with another comic book hunting video. Today is episode 16 and I am at the Geek Mania Con in Gloucester, my home city. I purchased a weekend pass and sadly I will not be returning tomorrow. It is a bust comic wise guys. I have picked up just eight books, eight. As I approach three o'clock, I will be being picked up soon. It seems to be a lot smaller than I remember. Half the hall has been shut down for talks, but there are very few people here. Now, parking has been put on hold at the venue due to it being flooded. So people are having to park about 10 minutes away and I think that is affecting the numbers. Let's take you around. Like I say, a lot of cosplayers, so many Funko Pops and figures and statues, swords. But if you're a comic lover like myself, it's pretty disappointing. I think there are two main comic sellers and a couple of bit pieces you know selling various things with a couple of boxes thrown in elsewhere psycho comics saved the con for me i picked up two pretty good issues from him a little bit of a gaming zone there photo area but there's vast spaces and I think they could have done a little bit more with the space that they had available. Like I say, I had the early bird pass, so I got here at 10 o'clock. And if there was a key issue here, guys, I picked it up, but not a lot on offer. Hello, Batman. But like I say, you can't knock the people for putting it on. I just think from now on I will be looking to hit comic marts and fairs next year instead of these comic con events. There's my mate Aaron. Say hello Ar. This is his little Planet All Stars store. Always got good stuff. Good guy. Sets me up with some real nice books. Now these statues did catch my eye. Some really good stuff here. Look, there's a rarity, comics. But this is Psycho Comics. The guy from the Midlands. A lot of slabs. No bites at the moment though for him, I don't think. Very disappointing for him, he said. Couple of the celebrities, there's Sylvester McCoy, Doctor Who. There's the TARDIS and the Daleks. Like I say, I've never known a con to be so empty. I'm very excited for my next haul though guys, I have picked up a mega book, I'm very excited to show it off. 
stay tuned for that. My next haul is probably going to be close to 70 books. It is enormous. And so many good keys. Like I say, these are the kind of stores that we're getting. Mix match. Telecomics are picked up there. Found one in a box down there. A pink stormtrooper. And there's a stormtrooper and a biker scout. Look. You're a little short to be a stormtrooper. Are you a bit hairy to be a princess? Good reply. Deserve that. <laughs> Star Trek ships there. Iron Man. My old friend Rocks Comics. <laughs> Some of the books he's got on offer there. Oh my God. There's a Daredevil one there. Low grade, but it's a Daredevil one. Lots of pretty cool knick-knack shops. It's all about the pops these days, guys. Even some of the comic sellers have started selling them. Nick Gribbon, illustration. Does some fantastic sketches. best con in my area is without doubt the True Believers event that happens in Cheltenham and that is in February for any of my UK fans get down to that one guys you will not be disappointed <laughs> t-shirt city That's pretty much it guys. Not very big and sadly disappointing on the comic front, but at least my city has a con. That's Daz over and out. Bye for now.